Hello and welcome to Waterflow. Persa has developed this video as part of their Water Market Literacy Program and it's one of a number of resources available to help you make the most of your water trading options. This video will show you how to register with Waterflow, find information about trading zones, research water to buy or sell, and help you learn more to plan your season ahead. To get the ball rolling, you'll need a Waterflow account. It's free to register. Just click here at the top of your screen. Complete your details, your name and email address. Then select your trading zone. Zone 12 is for the South Australian River Murray. Finally, type your password. Then type it again to confirm. Click on Submit and you'll shortly receive an email to confirm activation of your account. Click the activation link and now your account is created. To access Waterflow's features, you'll need to log in. Click the Login button, enter your username, which is the email address you signed up with, plus your password, and then click Login. Waterflow brings together water market information from various sources and delivers this essential, independent, up-to-date data directly to you. Once you've logged in, you can access this information by clicking Market Overview. Across the top of the page, you'll see various options to find what you're looking for. Starting with temporary water, you can view when water was last traded and the cost per megalitre. Scroll down to Zone 12. SA Murray to see the last five trades from our data providers. Click here. If you'd like more detailed information, click See Market Details. At a glance, we'll show you the zone map, storage levels and market spread. To get back to water prices, simply click the back arrow. If it's permanent water you're after, choose the Permanent Price tab. It uses a similar format as before and also shows options for the different types of water reliability. Under Sea Market Details, you'll find current allocations, five-year average and carryover allowances. To find out about storage and allocation levels, click on this tab and the percentages will appear for each zone. For up-to-date trade limits across the basin, click the Connectivity tab. For example, you can see if the Barmer Choke is open or closed and its current limit. Buying water can be a big outlay. River Murray irrigators have more than just the standard choices available to them. Waterflow will allow you to compare options across trading zones. If you're wanting to buy water into South Australia, click Buy Water. Choose either temporary or permanent and enter the amount of water you'd like to buy. Click Search and the most suitable options, which take into account the current trade opportunities from across the Southern Murray-Darling Basin, reflecting the current trade restrictions, will be displayed. The results are based on your default water trading zone. If your default zone is 12 SA Murray, then it will look at water available for purchase across zones connected to South Australia. You can change your trading zone in Settings. To do another search, click the back arrow and change your criteria. You can add extra search criteria by clicking Advanced Search. This enables you to add a minimum or maximum price per megalitre. Choose your source state or, for permanent water, change your trading zone. If you're considering selling water, click on Sell Water. It looks much the same as the Buy Water screen, but you can choose the zone from which you are selling. Click on Advanced Search if you'd like to add more details such as Forward Water, and then hit Search to view the results. Our Notifications tool is useful if you'd like to be alerted when water reaches a particular price or trade limits have changed. To set up a notification, click Notifications. Choose Rules and then click the Add button. 
Select the type of alert you'd like to set up, either a price alert or a trade limit alert. Complete the information and make sure you click on Save Notification. To amend a notification, click on Edit, update your notification requirements and click Save Notification again. To delete a notification, just click on the red garbage bin icon. Whether you're just starting out or an experienced market user, you may be interested to know that Waterflow has content to help South Australian irrigators in its water university. The Water Markets 101 section has loads of information about water trading. You can learn trade rules and limits, different types of water market products, plus a water glossary that explains each water trading term from A to Z. The Reports and Outlook section includes trade reports for temporary and permanent water in each zone. The standard time period is one year. But you can go back as far as five years. The Allocation Outlook report shows you projected allocation under various scenarios as the irrigation season progresses. You can select Zone 12 SA Murray from the drop-down menu and see the projected allocation from wet to extremely dry conditions. The Climate Outlook gives an overview of rainfall and temperature reports from the Bureau of Meteorology, providing you with a snapshot for the upcoming season. Now you've got the basics covered, you can use Waterflow as part of your toolkit for navigating the water market. There are lots of great resources available to help you learn more, stay informed, plan ahead and make the most of the water market. Head to the PERSA website to find out more.